Hello, this is Stevan Sheets and I'm going to show you how to convert a video from the ever unpopular uh, .mts format to a very popular .m4v format. Uh, this is a solution based on uh, our situation where uh, we have a Clover Sites website and uh, the Clover Sites website does not allow upload of the MTS format, which is a ACVHD format, apparently. Uh, it comes off of our Canon Vixia camcorder that we just purchased. It is a, an HD camcorder, very high quality, very nice quality that we have installed in our sanctuary and we are trying to uh, record our Sunday services. And uh, so I needed a solution and that solution to upload uh, a file format that works is Handbrake. Handbrake is a free, uh, a free file converting software uh, that's very popular. Uh, you can find it on the web. Uh, I'm using version 0 0.9.4. Uh, you can see the, the this right here. It's a very very simple to use, and I'm going to record this so that those uh, that come after me will know uh, how to use this, and maybe someone else will find this uh, easy to understand. So, uh, what we'll start with is Handbrake. This is Handbrake. Uh, we're going to first find a source, which is a video file uh, on my desktop called uh, 403.mts. It's uh, 123 megs uh, and it is an MPEG uh, hyphen TS video file. So we'll click that. Handbrake will look, look at that file and um, the solution I found uh, partially uh, online and uh, had to do a little bit of changing of it. Did not see a, a screen capture version of how to do this, so I had to make it myself. So here we go. Uh, the, the source is that file 00003. Uh, you can see it's two minutes and 35 seconds long, and uh, the destination uh, will go to my desktop. And uh, it, I'm going to change this quickly so that I can uh, not overwrite my current version. Uh, so we'll change this to uh, testvideo.m4v. Uh, thankfully, uh, Clover Sites accepts the m4v file format, and it's a very uh, nice compressed file that uh, is very popular on uh, both platforms, PC and Mac, right now. Uh, so the output file, the preset is going to be the container is the M MP4 uh, file, uh, which translates to m4v as the extension. Uh, I'm going to go over here and choose uh, that I want the iPod version uh, of, uh, of the settings and I'm going to actually increase this to 640 uh, here which is the size that's just the width and if I keep the aspect ratio it automatically puts in uh, the height of 368 pixels so it's going to be a 640 by 368 uh, video file here uh, which is the same aspect ratio as the source. The source is an HD 1440 by 1080 uh, HD video. So we're shrinking that down for the ease of uh, a file size to keep that small enough for us and uh, it makes Clover Sites very happy. So once I've done this, uh, the only thing I have to do next is click on the start button. Uh, and once I do that, a little um, window pops up here that shows me exactly uh, what's going to happen and the, the video is already processing in the background and we see that it is encoding uh, at a very you know not not horrible uh, rate this video is only two minute two and a half minutes long uh, so a Sunday service is going to be you know 30 to 40 minutes long so it will take significantly longer uh, but you see the process here and uh, once this is finished uh, it looks like we have about three minutes left but once this is finished the file will be on my desktop as testvideo.m4v uh, and I can upload that directly to uh, my Clover Sites uh, website. So there you have it. That's a quick tutorial on how to convert from MTS to M4V using Handbrake uh, for the benefit and use uh, in Clover Sites.